Come on, play with me a little bit here. This is not hard. This is just coming out of your resting state. It's coming out of your resting state. We're going in to the implicit order where all potentials exist that you have access to. Remember that central tube that runs up your body to the top of your head? We gotta change your physiology here. I want you to draw that energy up that straw to the top of your head, take a deep breath in, pull it all the way up to the top of your head, and I want you to hold it there. Let it build. And as you exhale, now relax. Come on now. We're disturbing the molecules in your body energetically. Don't think, just do it. Another breath in, draw it all the way up through your lower abdomen, your upper abdomen, through your chest, your throat, all the way to the top of your head. And I want you to hold it there now. Energy follows awareness. Let it build. Come on. And as you exhale now, relax. Another deep breath now. Come on, I want you to draw it all the way up. All the way to the top of your head. I want you to pull all that energy up to the crown and I want you to let it build. Hold it. And just release it into the field now. Yeah, it's happening. Come on. I want you to draw it up through your perineum now, through your lower abdomen through your upper abdomen, through your chest, all the way up through your throat and neck to the top of your head. Hold it there, pull it up. Pull it up with your intention. And hold it at the very top. And as you exhale, now relax. Come on, don't think again. Draw it up now through your lower abdomen, upper abdomen. Pull it up from your perineum, through your chest, through your throat and neck, through your brain to the top of your head. Like a very straight line, hold it at the very top. And as you exhale now, relax. Again now, come on, one more. Come on, draw it up now. Pulling that up through the straw to the top of your head. Pull it all the way up and hold it at the top of your head. The very top, let it build. Moving from survival to creation. And as you exhale now, relax. Come on, there's one more in there. One more. Come on, a little bit more. I want you to pull it up from your perineum, your lower abdomen, your upper abdomen, through your chest, through your throat and neck, all the way through your head to the top. Let it build there. Hold it to the very top. Let your energy move there. Hold it. And as you exhale, now relax.
Now, can you become aware of the space that your entire head occupies in space? From the tip of your nose, to your ears, to your chin, to the back of your head, all across your eyebrows, and the circumference of your head that occupies space in space. Stay present. Now can you become aware of the space that the column of your neck occupies in space? And the space that that part of your body is in, in space. Now can you feel the space that your upper torso occupies as a volume of space in space, your breastbone, tops of your shoulders, your shoulder blades, all the way through from your lungs and heart to your spine. Can you feel the space that that volume of space is in, in space? Now can you become aware of the space that your arms occupy in space, from your shoulders to your fingertips, including your wrists and elbows, and the flesh in between, and the space and the weight and density of your arms in space. Now can you become aware of the space that your lower abdomen occupies in space? And the space that your organs take up in space all the way to your flanks and spine. And the volume of space that that part of your body is in, in space. Can you become aware of the space and feel the space that your buttocks and pelvis occupy in space and the volume of space that your pelvis is in in space?
Can you notice the space that your legs are in in space? And the volume of space that your thighs and knees, calves and shins, your ankles and feet, the tops of your feet and the space that your entire lower extremities occupy in space? And the space they're in, in space? Can you notice the space that your entire body occupies in space? And the volume of space that your body takes up in space? Now can you sense the space around your body and the space around your body that occupies space in space? Now what about the space that this room occupies in space? And can you sense the space that this volume of space is in in space? Now can you sense the space right outside this room? And the space outside this room in space? Can you feel the space beyond the boundaries of this room in space?
Stay present. Stay present. Now, what was that first belief that you wanted to change based on how you used to think and feel? Remember it. What were the thoughts that that belief was based on? What did you say to yourself that you used to think was true? That really were just old circuits wired in your brain. Remember the old belief and become conscious of it. And what was the emotions? What were those emotions that you memorized? And how did those beliefs feel to you? Remember the emotional component, the feeling of that belief. It's energy stored in the body. Now I want you to surrender that belief to that great power within you that gives you life, that's both personal and universal. I want you to ask it to take it from you and organize it in a way that is just right for you.
Now make the conscious decision that you no longer want to believe this any longer about yourself. Make the decision. Remember it. Remember that this is no longer true about you. Remember, you're changing your belief. Now what do you want to believe about yourself? What belief do you choose now? And now make this a decision. Make it with firm intention, with certainty, so that you remember it. I want it to stimulate your body. I want it to become a gut feeling. Be certain about it and raise your energy with firm intention so that this thought is the experience that reconditions the body to a new mind, to a new emotion. Give yourself an electrical charge. Do it. Repeat it until you believe it. And let your body be in the emotional experience so it believes it is well. Change your energy. Come on, change it. Be emphatic, be clear, and be empowered. Make up your mind. Change your energy, come on. Give your body a new signal. Take this energy. And what was that second belief you wanted to change that was connected to the old self that you consistently thought about and continued? 
consistently felt to the point where it was an unconscious process that filtered your world and your perception into a box. Make the choice if you still want to believe it. Now make the decision with firm intention what you do want to believe about yourself and make it with an elevated heart and an emphatic mind. Make up your mind and send the signal to your body. This is what you do want to believe and make it an experience so that your body never forgets. Be empowered. Be the Lord of your destiny. Make your belief a new energy, a new energy. And remember it. Remember it and repeat it until your body and mind believe it. Be absolute. Let your body become electrified. You're walking through the gate. Be lifted. energized, be inspired, be invincible. Make this the new gut feeling. Inspiration is seeing a future without any obstacles. It's beyond analysis. It's knowing. There is a way to your destiny that is unpredictable that's driven by the profound energy of your emotion
Make your body believe it. Make your body believe it because it feels it and believes it's in the experience emotionally. Take one breath and draw it all the way up to the top of your head. And as you hold it there, I want this new energy to fill your being. And when I ask you to exhale, I want you to surrender this energy into the unknown. And exhale. Ready? You can open your eyes.